let me show you how to make free Twitch emotes in 2021. Just so you know though, in order to upload emotes onto Twitch, you have to be affiliated first. So if you're not affiliated on Twitch, you need to get an average of three viewers and a couple other categories. So if you need help growing your Twitch stream, I'll leave a playlist of videos in the top right corner that's gonna help you do exactly that. But assuming you're affiliated and you have the ability to upload Twitch emotes, let me show you how to do it. First things first, you wanna take a picture of yourself, whether that's gonna be through the webcam like I'm using now, or if you just wanna use your phone and take a picture of yourself, just keep whatever you wanna do and keep the idea is simple because remember you're working with the small palette but once you have the picture let's move on to the next step so first things first we got our picture right here let's go head on over to Google first thing we want to do is remove the background so I'm gonna go into Google and type in remove background and that's gonna bring us to remove.bg and this is just extremely simple we just go ahead and upload our image I got my image right here so I'm gonna open it or you can just drag and drop it and now it will quickly try to remove the background which it kind of did pretty well but my hair looks a little messed up but kind of look a uh, little skeleton like so let's uh let's fix that I'm gonna go into edit and then what you can do is I'm gonna add a picture behind it so you can better see what it looks like I'm just gonna go ahead click on erase and restore maybe maybe make my head a little bit not like that it kind of looks like I got like a hairdo from the 70s or something honestly you're not gonna be able to see all of these jagged lines when it's so small that looks a lot better but now I want to get rid of that background so I'm gonna go back to background click on color and then click on the checker box so now it's transparent so now let's go ahead click download now we have our transparent image right here after we click download image I got it right there now what we want to do is turn this into an emote so I'm gonna go to pixlr.com p-i-x-l-r.com 100% free I'm gonna click on create new and then over here you can name it I'm just gonna name it twitch emote and then the width it needs to be 112 by 112 so 112 by 112 once you have that done we're gonna go ahead and click create so now this is our little twitch emote box what I want to do is click on add image and then click on browse and I'm gonna go and navigate to the downloaded picture that we just downloaded so I got my picture right here I'm gonna double click it and that's gonna bring it here now we can kind of preview what the image is gonna look like in emote form without having to mess around with it so I'm just clicking and dragging and then I'm just dragging the corners to make it bigger and smaller so what we could do is just leave it like that what I want to do is since the emotes are quite small I'm actually gonna probably make it like this big just cuz you're gonna have a hard time like telling what it is if it's like super small like that that. so you can kind of have something like that or maybe if you really just want it like that you can do sign of like a force in emote if you know what that is but I'm gonna kind of go maybe leave it like that I think that's pretty good good so now what we're gonna do is click Save and then from here this is probably one of the most crucial things that you can do and that is clicking the like button <laughs> to help support this video just kidding but I would really appreciate if you did it what you want to do now is click download you can confirm that we have 112 by 112 because that's the emote size so download this so now it says twitch emote.png so now what we want to do let's go ahead and over to our twitch channel and then go to the top right corner go to creator dashboard you're going to click on viewer rewards and then you're going to click on emotes if you don't see this it's because you're not affiliated you need to get affiliated so check out the videos like I mentioned at the beginning click on emotes and then some of you might have follower emotes uh, but it's in beta so I'm assuming most of you don't so what you would do is just go over to your tier one or you can go to your bit tier if you have those unlocked but it's the same process for all of them so I'm just gonna do follower emotes because it's I don't have any there but it's the same exact process for all of them so just click on whatever one you want to add what tier you want to add to click on upload emote this box I'm gonna navigate to the twitch emote that we just made which is right here so I'm gonna go ahead double click that and then now you can see this is what the twitch emote looks like and it's a good thing that we we zoom zoomed in on it because it's very very small so now you can kind of see it's like an over exaggerated like pog champ face so now we get to name it so I'm just gonna do C pause M and then pog so whatever emote this is it's always gonna be like the first six letters of your username and then whatever you want them to type so if you just want them to type C pause M pog then you just type in pog here you can't really get rid of what this little prefix is here just because that's how it works so it's always gonna be C pause M and then whatever I want the emote name to be so now this is what the preview looks like like in light mode and dark mode I think it looks good so I'm gonna upload it here and then it says the emote has successfully uploaded into your library so that's good so now that we uploaded the cpaws m pog let's actually go to the channel so I'm gonna go to my channel real quick type it in and then now we can confirm that it'll work so if I go to my chat and then I go over here I'm going to type in C pause M and then capital P and then lowercase OG and if I hit it my if I move my webcam real quick now you can see that C pause M pog is a usable emote for the channel and that's how you make and upload your own free twitch emotes in 2021 if 
if you guys want to support the channel, feel free to check the description down below if you need some new streaming gear, if you want to check out the Patreon, everything's up to you. Otherwise, the channel all about helping brand new streamers just like you. So feel free to drop a like on the video if you got some value from it. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one.